Hi everybody, my name is Freddy Ella. I'm from Gabon and I'm going to give you a piece of me. I was born to a very young couple. My mother was 18 and my father was a young man of 20 who set such a hard and martinet education in my mind that I was psychologically traumatized. I avoided expositions, debates, public conversations, even though I had interest and passion. I even used to ask to my junior brothers to talk to my father for me. Up to the age of 20 or more, I kept to myself. I could not talk to people. I was so scared of all people of my parents' generation that I started and stammered when I spoke in front of them. One day, during a familial meeting, I was asked to give my opinion on a problem because I'm the leader of the grandson's generation. My way of speaking was catastrophic because I wasn't used to that. I was ashamed of myself and my parents disregarded what I said. I started to take part in public discussions to train myself to fight against the stutter and to defeat the shame and the stress. I wanted to be able to share my ideas with other people. At the beginning, it didn't work because I was afraid to talk rubbish or to lose a debate. People who regarded me as a leader were disappointed because I could not speak like I was expected to. I decided to focus on great political figures like Alan Claude Bilebinze, Pierre Mambundu Mambundu, Andre Mba Obam, Nicolas Sarkozy, and Barack Obama. I paid great attention to the flow to make my own speech more fluent and relevant. My English studies really helped me because I'm required to practice my speaking skills. Two years later, on May 13, 2015, I landed in South Africa to level up my speaking skills. My first challenge was to face the UCT private hospital staff for a small operation. Besides some misunderstandings, I didn't face difficulties because of their remarkable attention over me. I felt like a kid in his mother's hand. So no fear around me, it was great. At CPUT, a comfortable and confident atmosphere was set for me. I realized that I didn't need to be ashamed of my mistakes with my new teachers. I started to participate during classes so much that I often ask myself if it is really me speaking. I can't realize how much I'm getting involved in class. Consequently, I can feel something new in my speaking skills. I feel braver to hold the flow in front of people because it was impossible five months ago.